Welcome. The Google team has a great tip for you today. We're going to discuss paste as plain text, also known as paste without formatting. Sometimes you'll see it displayed in different ways depending on the app. But this tip can save you so much time. We always say that you spend way too much time on formatting instead of the content. The content is always the most important thing that you're working on. Let's alleviate all the time that is needed to adjust our formatting and spend the time focusing on our content. Let's go ahead and dive deeper about this tip and trick. As I show you this tip, I'm going to provide you how I do it and for my particular business need. Because really, in reality, many of us are copying data from one source and then putting it into a different source. And again, we spend too much time figuring out the formatting or it just really comes over in a not a very good fashion. So let's, let's talk about this and use it in a real case scenario for my business needs. I'm always sending Google Workspace updates. And here's an example. We have a new one with Smart Canvas. Not here yet, it's coming soon, but I do need to get ready for this content to be displayed for you guys. So one thing I always would do is always copy the uh, title of it because that's what makes sense for the particular update. I'll highlight it. I can use my shortcuts control C or right click and copy the data. I'm going to go ahead and go and start in Gmail first. I'm going to go ahead and compose and I'm going to go in full screen so you can see it easier. So many of us probably just right click or use the shortcut control V and paste the data. As you can see, it brought over the formatting, not exactly the way I want it to be displayed. It's got the hyperlink. It's just kind of messy on how I want to send this. Now I could go ahead, I'm just going to show you the example. I can return and I can do right click and paste as plain text. Please make note of the amazing keyboard shortcut because I use that as well. Control Shift V. Almost the same thing as Control V, but you need Control Shift V to get it to be plain text. I'm going to go and show you the example of plain text. Now you can see it just brings over the content. It did not bring over the link or the blue of any sort and not the same font. It's going by my default inside my Gmail. How easy is that? Because most of the time we just maybe want the content. Now some of us might want to do this in reverse order. Up here we know it brought over the formatting, the link, and so much more. Maybe we forgot that amazing plain text right click option. You can always go down here at the bottom and clear the formatting by clicking on the T with the slash and you'll remove the formatting as well. So that's another way to do so. Now let's go back and let's do a little different example and let's go into Google Docs because I like to copy my information into a Google Doc format. So I'm going to go back to the workspace update. I'm just going to copy some more data just to show you the difference. I'm going to go ahead and copy this information. Now I'm not showing you should copy word by word, but this again is a demonstration of copying content from one, con one source to another. So I'm going to go ahead and go back to my Google Doc. And this time you can do the same thing. In a sense, you can right click and choose paste without formatting. And you'll see it's going to go by your normal default text, in this case, Arial 11 in my particular example. You also have the reverse option. If you always want, you can go ahead and clear your formatting. This just gives you a clean start, right? It just saves you some time. So it's really helpful when you are creating your content because more, more than likely you're taking content from multiple sources and now you don't, they might have a Roboto 15, they might have it highlighted in red and all you want is the content and then you will adjust it from there. So that's a really nice tip. I really love it in Google Slides. Let's go ahead and show you in Google Slides. So I'm working on my Smart Canvas slide and I mean to make a new slide. Well, in slides, a lot of times you already have a theme and a format and you're trying to guess what it is. And so this is really nice that it just actually picks up the format that you have. So I, as you can see, I've already created a new slide. And so I'm going to focus on this new update that's regarding Smart Canvas. and I need to update this information. So you can probably see clicking in here, it says that it's Arial 25. All right. So let's go ahead and copy that title again because that's what I want to focus on. This is the title that I want. I'm going to do a control C. I'm going to go back to my um, Smart Canvas slide deck and go to the title. And now I could either use the keyboard shortcut of control shift V or I can right click and choose paste without formatting and watch what happens. 
it's then going to be Arial 25. If I would have actually done Control D as in Velcro or right click and choose paste, it's not going to be the same exact format that I would want because I want it to be the default format that's in that title. I know this seems like a lot of information, but what I can tell you is I ask you to encourage you to just try the paste without formatting or placed as plain text. It works in most apps and it's a really good way to reduce your time of updating formatting when you just paste the text alone. With that, I thank you for watching and enjoy this tip. Thank you.